Hello there, kau ada. Welcome to Kremwa TV. You mean me, Yaza? The thing is, eh, because interview with Dr. Kevin, ah, the di dah buka the thing yang arah bakar kat tu le, ah, tu latar pun, ah. Okay. Ah, question number one. So recently, a new kat tu le army was formed, and a lot of people are wondering what are your ah role and duty in the new kat tu le army. Thank you for asking me to share. With respect to the Kathule Army, I have no role. I just support General Nerdabomia and his vision for freedom and independence. Why do current people need this new Kathule Army? I think it reflects that the Karen supporting General Nerda, they see him as their leader, and he has much support from his constituents. And I think they want representation uh, and a path forward to freedom that he offers that may be different from some of the others. The greater need is for all of the leaders at the top to come together, and that would bring the people together, in my opinion. So, what type of action will the Katule Army take to tackle the Burmese Army that is different from KNU and CA? I'm not sure what action Katule Army would take. I'm not privy to that information, but I do know that General Nerda welcomed me providing some advice on a code of conduct uh, for his soldiers. Uh, that he will put in place, and some of the rules that will be included is prohibiting against the use of any child soldiers. Also, how prisoners should be treated by international standards of the Geneva Convention of 1949, and the treatment of women and children impacted during armed conflict. Those are very important. I was pleased that General Nerda agreed, believing that these items are um, very important. As far as KNU, NCA, they have different methods of dealing with things. I think there can be a hybrid combination if people work together. My hope is that all the Karen armies can work together to defend our Karen. Can you give us a glimpse to some of the goal that the new Ar Katule army have been planned? I do not have information about that, but my hope is is that they will defend our Karen, and they would work with other ethnic people that also have similar goals of seeking freedom. And self determination from the Burmese generals. The more everyone comes together, uh, the stronger it is, and the harder it will be for the Burmese generals to continue. Okay. Uh, since the new Katule army was formed, uh, there's a lot of misunderstanding uh, from different Karen group in the Karen communities. Do you have any word that you like to share or address to, you know, the people who misunderstood the new Katule army? I really pray and hope that all will come together to defend our Karen that is suffering under the hands of the corrupt and brutal uh, Burmese generals. This has gone on for so long. All different sides, all the different groups, have so much talent, and when those talents are brought together um, collectively, there is exponential strength, and unity can be a reality. The greatest weapon against the Burmese generals is a united front. Can you share a few words to the people that support and believe in the new Katule Army? I think it's important that we all try to see from a different vantage point from those that we may disagree or that disagree with us. We must learn to forgive one another and focus on the future. For me, I am reflecting much during these difficult times that we see around the world, conflict everywhere, with many countries. I understand um, that you know. People have passion for their belief and their position on things, and as people have their beliefs, I think all sides have valid points. We have to just take a step back. And maybe for me, one lesson that I've learned is to be careful in posting things when someone sends me something, and I think it's one thing, and then I post it, and then others tell me that it, it was something else. And so for me, you know, I have to reflect and say. Okay, that's going to hurt and divide rather than bring people together. So that's a lesson for me. But I think we all must reflect on that. Thank you, Doc, Dr. Kevin, uh, for taking your time to do the interview with us. And I hope this uh, clear out all the misunderstanding uh, in our current community. And uh, thank you, everybody, uh, for watching this video. Please, uh, if you have anything to say or comment, please comment down below on this video. And uh, we'll see you next time.